Hello everyone, we're back. Nashi, the conservative gamer. We're here doing raw beast hide leather. This still works, and I cannot believe it. So, we're down here in Warlords of Draenor Grenade <laughs> Grand. And we are farming some raw beast hide. This is an unlimited farm. So, uh basically oh this person actually might mess it up. Kill these guys. They keep on respawning. You just stand here all day. And just bing bang boom. Just constantly respawning. Uh, monks obviously the best for this particular farm. Just because the totem, the black ox totem is so good in this. As you can see it kind of gathers them all up. Um, you kind of have to learn where to position it good. I haven't perfectly reacquired the spot because I haven't done this in a long time. But... This is, by far, hands down, the best immediate way to farm raw beast hide and to level your wad skinning. This also gets you a fair amount of sumptuous fur if you need some right away as well, uh, in case you're a tailor, and I'll, uh, you know, add this spot on the tailoring video when I get to that point. But this is definitely a, a great spot, so there's, there's really only one other good way in this whole game to gather the materials from wad. Uh, more efficiently and by efficiently I mean kind of passively if you if you just want to build up to that point and you don't need to level up your skinning then I can show you the best way to do it all right we're back at your garrison the horde garrison looks cool in my opinion but uh, you know some people like the lame alliance one but that zone sucks what you want is a barn barn level 3 is the best because you can farm the biggest barn animals that you can with the traps here and you just pick up a deadly trap and you just take it with you so we got our deadly trap we're gonna put it on our bar here uh let's see we want for leather we either do the cleft hoofs or the elks as you can see it tells us which materials each thing that we cage farms now i will show you again we're going back to the grand and the best way to farm the raw b side i'll show you Okay, we're here in the Grand again, and you want to be right here, just west of the Throne of Elements. You want to look for these Iron Hide Bulls, which are the elite ones, and you want to just drop a trap underneath, hit them with a weak move, and they'll get trapped as soon as they're below 50% health. And uh, then you will get a caged Mighty Cleft Hoof, which um, uh, they turn into significant amounts of raw beast hide. Now... With your barn at level three, you can use you can do the best ones, which are these ones. But basically, you do this for an hour and a half, and you'll have enough to constantly keep your barn stacked for a month almost of just constantly getting raw beast hide. Now, normally you don't need that much, and uh, it's really cheap to buy in the auction house. But definitely keep this in the back of your mind if you're ever trying to level up your Draenor leatherworking or skinning or trying to get your own transmog or something like that. This is a great way. It's This is my way. This is how I farm the raw beast side. As you can see, I have uh, close to... It looks like I have 4,300 currently raw beast side, and I've only done it this way on three different characters. Um, and I did it for one month, and I got 4,600. And I didn't even do it every single day. So definitely, definitely... Uh, uh, keep in mind, I'll never need raw beast side again, but this is definitely the best place to farm it over the long term, and killing those unlimited spawn cleft hoof still is the best way to get it right away. I just want to say thank you so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate the support. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. One of my goals this New Year's uh, is to try and get over a couple thousand subs, and uh, I'll do a U.S. token giveaway for every, um, you know, for the first thousand, and then for the next thousand, and then for when I get to five thousand, uh, and I freaking, you know, I love World of Warcraft, I hope it gets better, I'm definitely going to be playing lots of classics, so if you're playing classic, I'm making a huge guild, uh, don't be afraid to leave a comment below, and, uh, make sure I'll, I'll make sure to invite you. Thanks so much for watching me again, guys, it is Nashi, the conservative gamer, we'll be back next time.